City of Hope was founded to make a difference in people's lives, to give hope to people who've been diagnosed with cancer, diabetes, and other life-threatening diseases. Right now, we're in the forefront of medicine. They want a cure, and they're pushing us for a cure, and they're right to do that because we can do it. We have one of the largest and most exciting CAR-T clinical research programs in the entire world. And it's making breakthroughs against a wide variety of cancers. There's been a revolution in our understanding of cancer and our ability to target abnormalities in a cancer cell. As medicine advances, we like to not just treat every tumor similarly, but find specific characteristics on the tumors and then address those specific problems. The therapies that we're using now on the immune side are literally a person's own immune system. We are making it personal. We're trying to re-engineer their immune system. Where we have not only the antibody approaches, but vaccines, targeted therapies uh, using T cells that can actually destroy the cancer. One of the treatments that we're testing is the use of stem cells to target brain tumors. And we're using the stem cells to release chemotherapy in the brain. That was developed at City of Hope. All of this has evolved in a period of the last decade, and it's revolutionized the way we provide care for individuals. Even to this day, when I see blood counts coming up after a therapy that we've done, or looking at films to see that cancer has shrunk because something that we did, gives me a chill. It's about making people whole. Our care does aim for that, preserving who people are. You get to see the amazing things that these people then go out and do in their life. If you can liberate them from this disease that brought them to us in the first place.